Recently, I have installed Ubuntu, brand new Ubuntu 22.04 and I have NVIDIA GPU, NVIDIA 3060. Okay, so right now what problem I am facing is the GPU fans are not starting automatically. That's the problem I am facing. So exact same problem can be exist on your side. That's why I am recording this particular video, right? So I would like to mention few more points. The solution I'm going to provide that will work on all types of Ubuntu, all type of Linux OS, including the Saint OS and Kali Linux, etc. And the solution I'm going to provide you will work on all NVIDIA GPUs with all models. In my case, my GPU model is NVIDIA RTX 3060. Okay, so let's continue with this particular thing. Okay, so first thing you need to do is you need to open a terminal so we need to make sure one thing that nvidia settings package is installed okay so first thing first before moving forward we should have nvidia settings package in some of you cases the nvidia settings package is already installed if, if you have installed drivers already but in some cases it might be possible that the package is not there okay so in my case the package is there so i will show you nvidia uh, settings the package is right here but if the package is not exist in your case you can just do sudo uh, apt install nvidia uh, settings okay so that should uh, install nvidia settings so in my case the package is already there so let me hit the control c and i can open the uh, NVIDIA settings right here okay from this or I can just go ahead and search uh, NVIDIA settings in the application and I can open it from there okay so here as you can see there is a thermal settings option available so there is a GPU 0 which is NVIDIA RTX 3060 which is my GPU and there is a thermal settings so in this particular option you can enable settings manually manually right not automatically manually every time you reboot you need to uh, uh, enable this particular thing manually okay so if you enable this particular thing manually and increase the fan speed right here and click and apply it will apply the fan speed and fan will start running okay so as you can see the speed is right there rpm is right there but how we can do it automatically so as you can see i am uh, doing this uh, turning this particular thing off and as you can see the speed go on to zero okay so let me just uh, split my terminal and uh, so that i can just uh, show you better way okay so right now i'm just splitting the terminal and i will do a different activity in this particular terminal it is not necessary to open using terminal i can just hit ctrl c also if you are a little bit confused and i will open uh, from my application menu also right so this is right here let me uh, move to the right and as you can see it is right here the fans are disabled the speed is not there and this is my another terminal so here i what i'm going to do is in home directory uh, this is my home directory i'm going to create one folder called scripts or let's say helper okay so let's say uh, uh, let's say helper right so let's do a cd into the helper do ls and let's do nano and let's say gpu is underscore let's say fan dot sh or something like that right so it should be bash script okay so the script I, I am going to show you it's a bash script okay and then you need to paste this particular thing in it okay so right now i will tell you what is happening right here this nvidia settings and this particular command is enabling the gpu enabling the gpu okay so let me split the terminal my terminal and i will show you what is happening so let me just copy this particular first command and just paste it here so as you can see as soon as paste this enable option is turned on let me copy the second command and let's paste it right here and as you can see it is setting the speed to the 75 and uh, the span, uh, fan has started running but my uh, gpu has a three fans okay not two fans three fans so in your case your uh, gpu is having two fans then obviously when you uh, hit this particular one command only it will start both of the fans but in my case there are three fans so what i'm going to do i'm going to paste exact same command just i'm going to select the fan 0 to fan 1 and hit enter and as you can see the second fan will start running right here okay so that's what this command is doing so let me uh, just copy this particular thing again and just paste it right here and replace this particular fan speed with one and by default i want to keep all uh, the fan speed to let's say uh, 60 i don't want to just you know uh, keep load on fans so i'll keep the 60 that's it okay or you can just say 55 or something like that also okay 
uh, then I'm going to hit Control S and Control X to save this particular file. If you do, let's say, cat right here, as you can see, these are the contents of the file. These are the exact same content you need to put in the file. Okay. If you have three fans, then only put the last line. Otherwise, you can just go with the, this particular thing. Okay. So let's go ahead and let's do LS and let's uh, change the permissions, add the executable permission to this particular file. Okay. So how we can do it? Uh, we need to do ch mode and plus uh, x and then file name and if you do ls it is turning green that means we can execute this particular file okay so let me just do uh, uh, quickly disable this particular fans and let me just uh, you know execute this particular script right here and as you can see it is doing the thing great we are great uh, once it is done and it is you know uh, showing the rpm of the fan right here okay great so let me just clear everything right here and what we are going to do is we are going to use the con tab in order to execute this particular script okay so how we are going to do okay so let me do pwd ls and i will show you how i am going to do it okay so basically whenever the pc is rebooting or laptop is rebooting uh, mostly this problem is in the uh, desktop only not in the laptop so whenever the this the particular desktop is uh, booting or rebooting or let's say computer is starting then it will wait for some time and then it will execute one cron job which will be responsible for starting this particular let's say uh, fans right so this is how the process is going to be so how we will do it we will just paste this particular command which is cron tab dash e so in my case i will just paste in an, uh, another terminal because in this terminal i have the file name and path right here right so i will just uh, so I will paste this particular command right here and hit the enter and if you go to the bottom of the file there is nothing okay so basically what we are going to do is we are going to add some code right here okay so basically we are going to see after boot or reboot or system on wait for 60 seconds this is the 60 second and then execute the uh, script so this is the path of the script so let's just uh, add the path of the script right here and that should be it and that will execute the script okay so if you want to just confirm you can just copy this particular path and paste it right here and hit enter and as you can see it is turning on right here the gpu fines are turning on okay great so let's do go ahead and let's save this particular con tab and hit control x that will exit exit from the file right so right now you have done everything right right now you can if you want to test it i don't want to test it because i already know that uh, this solution is working right because i have tested on my system before uh, i'll be not rebooting my uh, desktop but in your case if you want to check if this solution is working or not just go ahead and reboot this particular uh, system or desktop and see if the fans are starting automatically or not okay so if the fans are starting automatically uh, congratulations uh, the solution is here and it is solved uh, if the fans are not starting automatically then what you can do is you can put your problems in the comment you can put uh, which system you are using which OS is there what is the version of the OS and what is the model name of your GPU is it RTX or any GT series of the Nvidia or is it something else okay so you can put all the details in the uh, uh, comment box and I will try to help you uh to solve your problem right so yeah that's all and thanks for watching see you in the next